I hate more than anything waking up to work out in the morning. I'm raspy in my voice. My eyes are tired. I'm tired. That's all I got. <laughs> I really hate working out, getting up and working out. I enjoy-ish the workout. I'm enjoying them more. I feel better when I do them. And I have to say this now while I wait for the place to open. Like, I am i can't not be early. Like, I can't not be early. Plus, I don't want to miss out on a minute of my workout because I have to leave right after my workout because I'm going to go meet my sister, Ruby. She has Olivia, and I'm going to pick up Cody on my way home from picking up Olivia. And we're going to make a little uh, shopping date out of it. Well, I hope that you can see a difference in my demeanor because I am a new person now that I am done. Genuinely, I feel like a freaking million bucks. But, oh, hello, where are you? Here, you're right here. There you are. Hi, lady. Oh my god. Hi. That was the fastest get ready in the history of ever getting ready of my entire life. Oh, not too shabby, Bon. I wanted to be casual, but I wanted to be cute and I wanted to be comfortable because I'm driving like an hour and 45 minutes actually there. So, this is what I chose to wear. This is our blush dress from Bali Brand and I'll leave it in the description for you guys. And my arms driving, I seriously was like, oh, they need rest, I need relief. My arms are so tired from the workout. I purposely got here early, so I purposely woke up a half hour before I was supposed to this morning to edit my pictures and write a caption, and now I have to like do all of my posting that's required of me today before I go in, so it's like a timing thing, and I didn't want to be late to partying. So, it's 9.50, the mall opens at 10, Ruby will probably be here like right at 10. So, I have 10 minutes to make my post, and then I'm gonna go inside. Hey, remember all that rushing I did? They don't open till 11. Remember how I woke up extra early? Remember how I like rushed here and then sat in my car and did my work very rushed? I have an hour! <laughs> hour! It feels so good to be in the shopping center! I think I see the girls. <laughs> You're excited to see me! <laughs> That makes me, here I'll give you a real hug. That makes me excited that you guys are happy to see me. <laughs> Hi. Hi cutie. Hi. Um, you did get new shoes. Did Aunt Ruby buy them? No, they're mine. I don't want them anymore. Really? <laughs> um, and my birthday, she could just steal my shoes and go. Happy birthday, Ruby. <laughs> well, those are the exact shoes that she was like wanting. wanting. She wanted those ones. They're so cute. Thanks, Abby. We're heading up to the second floor, which has a few more delicate items. And if you're interested in what we pick out, if you have a daughter that might need a few suggestions, I'll put some links in the description below. Okay, I am laughing so hard. The girls are so giggly. Ruby didn't tell the girls what we were coming to do today. The girls thought we were just going regular shopping. So they're all very surprised, very like, giggly and funny about all of it. Yeah, no, no, okay. Me and her are sisters, me and, and they're our cousins. Me and the tall one are sisters, and then, the, and then the little teeny one is our cousin. The little teeny one. I'm the little man. I'm sure it's Jimmy. The little man? <laughs> Interesting. Online menus. Mm -hmm. How the world is changing. She's <laughs> <laughs> broken like four dishes in the last month and she's over here like. <laughs> Easy does it. Easy does it. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
I don't think you need to really, you don't need to like, cut it. Just, <laughs> just scoop it up. Just take a big scoop bowl. I get little buggies if I'm not, yeah, they like every, ew, oh, it's like moving. Okay, well, oh hmm. I am not going to allow that to ruin my lettuce experience over here. Maybe the diarrhea that comes with the bugs might ruin it, but, but I'm not gonna let it ruin my journey of eating it. Today is a cool and very exciting day on the house. We are, if you can see that little bit of light through there, we are cutting the egress windows out, which is gonna make this basement feel so, I don't know, just almost like it's an upstairs because it's gonna have huge, big windows. It's gonna open it up. I'm doing a kind of tutorial about it on my channel, Today's Task. And if you guys have not checked out Today's Task, I will leave a link in the description down below for you guys to go check it out. But this is the project we're working on today and I am super excited about it. And I'll show them when all the holes are actually in the walls. Coming into Lululemon, only three of us. Oh, who's coming with me? You guys keep going. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay, there's only room for three more people. So put on your face masks. Here you go, Olivia. Okay. And we'll sanitize our hands. And then when there's room, Ruby and everyone else can come. Ruby hasn't purchased any Lululemon and I've been telling her how much I love it and mostly how much I love it for Joel. <laughs> Okay, when I see myself in the mirror, that answers my question. I'm not going to get this top. The top is a little um, tight, but these bottoms are super high-waisted, and I wanted a pair of shorts. So I think I'm gonna get the blue shorts, and Olivia's gonna get the blue leggings. For size reference, Olivia is a size 02. Crop, they, they have to be the cropped. And they fit her so good, and hers come up high. Come up high. And she wanted a top and she is a size two, turn around. Oh, your hair's cute. A size ah. two in the top, and we're going to go here. You hold the camera. We're gonna, Olivia wants to learn how to tie a knot. Cause my mom does it really cute, and I really like it. So, cross your hands. Okay. Cross them over. Okay. Grab one. Okay. Okay, fist it in there like that. <gasps> That's so cute. <laughs> I like that. Isn't that cute? That's and then, cute. do you wanna know what I do now? Instead of doing that because it doesn't really stay. Well, you can grab it on the side. Yeah, I like that. I'm gonna try it on my own. The music in this place is making me wild. Um, I just grab a hairband and I put the little hairband in so you don't stretch your shirt out. See how it's stretching your shirt out? I don't love doing that. We'll get one of those clear hairbands and we'll I'll show you how to tie it. Okay, does that work? Yay! Okay, I will link what we're getting in the description for everybody. Ruby thought the girls looked really cute coming down the escalator and she couldn't get her camera out in time. So she, so she sent them back up and they're coming down. Did you hear her? She said, she said, talk and laugh. <laughs> Act natural. <laughs> ah, they have to do it again. <laughs> Well, I picked up one child, and now I am on my way into my parents to pick up my other child. I've been two children short from what I typically am. My mom's yard is coming in. It looks so good. It looks so nice out here. Okay, I do have to tell you this. We were at a store, and one of the sales associates was like, oh, I really love your dress. And it was everything in me to be like, thank you, I designed it. I just walked into my mom's house and they're having a pillow fight. They're having a pillow fight. If you don't follow my mom, <laughs> oh he, oh okay, he's sad to see me. That's cool. <laughs> if you watch my mom's stories on Instagram, you'll know they were lighting bugs on fire with um, what's it called, a magnifying glass. All the boy things is what, is what these boys have been up to. There was so much work drama that I had to come home to that we've been working on. So there was a little sitch situation. I'm gonna sit right here because this is what I like to do. And my favorite thing is like, Lighting, mood lighting. It seems really bright in the viewfinder, but it's really not. Oh, it just doesn't even look moody in here because the camera's like auto brightening. But it's like kind of moody and dark. 
So I wanted to sit down and talk about bra shopping. I did not think it was very important when I was young and so I always wore the like wrong size Victoria's Secret. I do not think Victoria's Secret bras are good. I just don't think they are. I think that if you want to have the correct fitting bra, I know Dillard's and Nordstrom they measure you for free and they tell you exactly what size you are. They come in the dressing room and they'll show you like, okay, it doesn't fit here or it doesn't fit here. Or it's not fitting down here. They're very good at what they do. And if you're not wearing the right bra size, and this is for anyone that this applies to, a lot of times you just sit inside of your bra and you just kind of hang there and you're not being supported and your tissue is really delicate and your tissue will break down and that's what can cause sagging is if you're constantly wearing the wrong bra size take it from someone that has cried in the dressing room like basically all my life <laughs> better okay it's very important to wear the correct bra size and anyway so it was really fun my mom was always really good about taking me in and getting me a good bra anyway like I said I'll link the ones that we bought in the description they're a little more expensive there are some things that I think you can skimp on bras are not one of them especially where they last for so long you wear them every single day like your bed mattress I don't skip on a bed mattress skincare I don't skimp on skincare that's my little tidbit I want to close the vlog on that note thanks for watching today was a really fun day I wanted to vlog so much more but I wanted to keep things discreet and I wanted the girls to have a really good time it was a really fun day and I will remember it Olivia will remember it the cousins will remember it so anyways that's the most important thing I love you guys. Bye.